The Bank of England policymaker Catherine Mann claims that the UK's withdrawal from the EU free trade area and subsequent trade barriers have contributed to the inflation crisis in the country. According to Mann, cited by Bloomberg, while the US and the EU are showing signs of the cost of living crunch beginning to abate, the same cannot be said for the UK. Mann stated at the Lamphalussy Lectures Conference in Budapest that all three regions faced shocks to demand and supply caused by the global demand rotation and supply bottlenecks due to the COVID pandemic and lockdowns, as well as the energy shock from Ukraine-related sanctions on Russia. However, the UK is unique in that it unilaterally imposed trade barriers on its closest trading partners, a third type of shock. Inflation in the UK reached a four-decade high of 11.1% in October but has since slightly cooled down to 10.5%. Despite this, it remains above the Bose 2% target. Meanwhile, inflation in the Eurozone has fallen back to 8.5% and in the US it has declined to 6.5%. Mann wondered if a turning point is already visible in the data for the US and the Eurozone, but for the UK, it may only stabilize. Last week, the BOE revised its estimate of potential output to 0.7% for the next three years, blaming a constellation of economic shocks, including Brexit. This figure is down from its November estimate of 0.9%. The central bank also reiterated its prediction that the UK's level of productivity would be around 3.25% lower in the long run, due to its withdrawal from the EU free trade area.